the fall here in West Lafayette. Husker fans were wondering how low it could get this season for Nebraska. Well, it happened today, Halloween 2015, a one in six Purdue team that hadn't won since September 12th, put up 55 on the Huskers. We gave them such easy shots. Uh, we actually held up for a long time defensively making some plays, but you know, whether it was third or fourth down, whatever it was, they, they, they capitalized. And giving them a short field was a big, big deal. Five turnovers gave the Boilers a short field, and boy, would they capitalize, scoring four touchdowns. It's pretty tough, but uh, we can't control that. We just play defense, man. Whatever, whatever, the, whatever predicament we're in, we, uh, we got to fight our way out of it. They executed well, and uh, you know, they capitalized on a lot of a lot of good situations for them. Well, no matter where you take the field, and that's one thing that we've done uh, well with during the course of the season, we've played well down the red zone and uh, specifically kept people to field goals, and uh, uh, we weren't we weren't able to do that. As for Riker Fife's first start, Mike Riley called it a mixed bag: 400 yards passing with four touchdowns, but four interceptions, and he spread it around to 10 different Huskers. I thought he really made some throws and some plays, and, and uh, you know, like, like I said, I think we went through that rough spot <clears throat> in, the, in the middle there that really set us back, but for the most part, I was really proud of him. I thought he played pretty well. Um, he kept his composure, you know, throughout the game, you know, all the guys who are, you know, have that game experience, we're just telling them, to, you know, just be relaxed, keep playing, just act like it's practice, just, you know, just do your fundamentals and you'll be all right. And I thought overall he played a good game. I thought for the most part he was looking at the right people and, and going through the progression and, and uh, he, you know, he, he moved the ball for us a lot of times pretty well. Garrett, we may not have seen rock bottom yet because Michigan State comes to Lincoln next week for a primetime game at Memorial Stadium. In West Lafayette, Indiana, Phil Aldridge, KTV, Action 3 Sports. That